Hi, I'm Addison Leonard, and I will be examining the global issue of indifference with Dante Alberti's The Inferno. In his epic poem, The Inferno, Dante Alberti explores the idea of indifference and its selfish effects on humanity, which can be analyzed through the lenses of contemporary society. Indifference in contemporary society is best depicted through the examination of important political movements, such as the human rights Black Lives Matter movement that is happening in the United States, the authoritarian regime that is currently happening in North Korea, unfair working conditions that can be found all over the world, and the upcoming disaster that is global warming. Matters as important as these don't have the luxury to have a neutral side or people on those neutral sides. By being neutral in the face of adversity, the evil side will continue to be prominent, continue to plague our society. Dante expands on the idea of indifference more so specifically in Canto 3, as he focuses on people who are neither with or against God. On line 32 to 37 in Canto 3, Dante asks the reader to narrow their lenses as he says the following lines. These are the nearly soulless who live concluded neither blame nor praise. They are mixed here with that despicable corpse of angel who are neither for God nor Satan, but only for themselves. The high creator scourged them from heaven for its perfect beauty, and hell will not receive them, since the wicked might feel some glory over them. Dante is orchestrating these thoughts so the reader can understand why the indifference were plays on the outskirts of hell. Within hell, these were the real sinners, or the people who haven't repented for their actions, away for the rest of eternity, but they cannot be in heaven because heaven is full of good people who chose to be in the light of God. With line 37, Virgil calmly explains the history of the sinners and why they are where they are. This helps the reader characterize Virgil as a kind and understanding mentor towards Dante. The Tesseracts containing lines 34 through 39 can be inferred that Dante believes them to be selfish. Dante uses negative diction in a horrific imagery that has the indifferent souls in pain and in torture. Followed by this ex explanation and the negative connotations of his words, Dante illustrates the horrific picture of imagery of their suffering with maggots and worms being swarmed around them and blood dripping down their faces. The juxtaposition of light of limbo and the next candle with the description of symbolic some symbolism full of anguish and despair shows Dante's inner thoughts. Dante is not afraid to show the reader how bad he thinks the indifference were. He doesn't think of them as evil, but necessarily selfish, and he thinks that by not even allowing Satan to their lives, they just truly don't have a passion and they don't care. Throughout the book, or throughout the poem, Dante has symbolic retribution as one of the big themes throughout it. He believes that the sinners choose their own punishment. They choose to be punished, and they choose to be in hell for eternity. This is apparent in Canto 3, in line 47, as Virgil explains to Dante that they, referencing the indifferent souls, have no hope of death. They don't hope to be rescued by God or for repenting for their actions. The indifferent souls don't care that they are sinning. They just don't have a passion for God and they don't have a passion for Satan. They have no hope of death and being reunited with their with a high creator. They follow the path and the theme of symbolic retribution by just staying in the circle of torture for all eternity. In addition to symbolic retribution, Dante explores the theme of indifference broadly with strong emotions that is apparent from both Dante and Virgil. Dante is often seen chastised by Virgil for showing pity towards the sinners or rewarded for his anger and his disgust through those. Dante has strong feelings and is rarely seen as indifferent, which can support the harsh description of the indifferent. By having Dante, the main character, not ever be indifferent towards the sinners, it can help the reader understand why Dante would have such a negative connotation of the indifferent souls now in Canto 3.
overall, the Inferno does portray a lot of global issues, but in my opinion, it shows indifference in a very well and clear light that can be seen in contemporary society currently happening today in poems that were written hundreds of years ago. Thank you.